It doesn't make it okay for police to ride horses into situations where they know they're endangering their animals, and it doesn't make it okay for people protesting or riding to ride horses on streets and put their horses in danger as well. Both sides should be charged with animal abuse, in my opinion. Hey bitch, and welcome back to me talking about people I hate. Before I get into this video, I want to start off by saying a massive thank you to Coldest Water for again sponsoring another video. Their link is down below if you want to head over and check them out. Your girl got new hair. <laughs> Let's talk about it. Thank you so much to everyone who was just loving and gushing over my hair the other day. As a narcissist, it was truly appreciated to just hear people gush over how fucking great I look. <laughs> but let's go ahead and get into this video because I've got so many other videos that I'm waiting to upload because I feel like there's one thing after another that keeps coming up. And this is something that I need to get out of the way that I need to talk about. Now I, have been very much staying out of talking about all of the political drama that's been going on because this is not a political channel even though I care about human rights as much as I do animal rights. This is an animal activist channel and I have to treat it as such. However, I have spoke out on the Black Lives Matter issues and human and social rights in the United States on my Instagram. But I do wanna say that if you are sensitive to racial issues, don't worry, this video is not about race, this is not about either side of the political argument, this is about fucking stop using horses in protests or rallies, police included. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and jump into the ramp because I am so mad right now. I am so sick of people using horses to parade around on in all of these major cities and protests and riots. You guys are placing an innocent animal's life at risk. You guys are placing an animal in harm's way, which constitutes animal abuse and neglect. Same goes for police. There is no fucking reason why any police officer needs to be mounted on a horse that they know is gonna have bricks thrown at it. Police officers should not be riding live animals into dangerous situations because if you want to be a part of that situation, if you want to get involved in a dangerous situation like a riot, that's on you. Don't put an innocent animal's life at risk because I understand police horses are very, very, very well trained. I get that. Those horses will go into harm's way. And that's not a good thing because you guys have a responsibility to care for the well being of your animal. Your animal is not your shield. <laughs> I hate it when I hear people say that police horses are trained to deal with situations like this. No, they're not. I mean, they are, but they're not. Because the majority of the time, police use horses to just walk around in cities, which is debatable anyway, because it's not good for horses to be walking on concrete for long periods of time or asphalt. It does extreme damage to their ligaments, to their tendons, to their joints, to their hoof structure. There's so many negative effects of walking horses consistently or rigorously on hard ground. So let's get that out of the way first. Horses on either side of the argument or political debates should not be walked on solid ground. They should not be placed in dangerous situations by either side. From what I've seen, there has only been one person who has in my opinion, adequately ridden their horse in a protest at a walk and kept their horse out of harm's way. And then 
loaded their horse up and took their horse home. That's how it should be done. If you want to do something like that, do something like that. But there are so many videos of horses being abused left and right, and I have tried for the fucking life of me to keep my mouth shut about this because I don't want people coming at me being like, you're racist for speaking out about this. You know, you're this for speaking out about this. This is not about people. This is not about which side is right or wrong. This is not about political debates or rioting. This is about putting animals' lives at risk or in danger. I mean, there have been so many protesters who have ridden horses on roads literally until their hooves started bleeding. There are so many people who have gotten horses hit by cars or hit in the face with bricks, police included. <laughs> There's just so many animals that have been abused left and right throughout all of these political protests that are going on. And the fact that nobody understands or sees how wrong this is, nobody is speaking out about this. I'm so sick of it. Like, I'm not going to sit back and continue to let this shit slide because it's like every day there's new shit popping up in the news where there's horses that are literally being beaten and abused in protests and riots, but it's okay because it's a protest or it's a riot. It doesn't make it okay for police to ride horses into situations where they know they're endangering their animals, and it doesn't make it okay for people protesting or rioting to ride horses on streets and put their horses in danger as well. <laughs> should be charged with animal abuse in my opinion especially all of the police officers who rode their fucking horses into these giant riots and crowds and then were completely shocked that people who were already outraged and extremely angered took action against an animal that can't fight back <laughs> Because a horse is not like a police dog. Police dogs are trained to attack people. They can fight back. That's what they're trained to do. Horses don't fight back, and especially not very well-trained police horses. They don't fight back. These horses have been so abused, so fucked up by people on both sides. I'm sick of it. Stop riding horses in political riots or rallies. People need to just stop doing it all together. I know there's a few people who have done it successfully, and I really don't care because I don't want to condone shit like this of any kind. I don't think it's okay to ride horses in any sort of dangerous situation just because you want to get attention, just because you want people to notice you like, ooh, look at me, I'm on a horse. No, it's dangerous for other people, it's dangerous for you, and it's ultimately dangerous for the fucking horse. People should not be allowed to willingly put their animals in harm's way just because they're sitting on their backs. Okay, that's my rant for today. I know that it was nothing much, but I do have some very in-depth and detailed videos coming out in the future. I just really wanted to get this rant out of the way because I'm, I'm just so sick of this. I can't even explain to you how unbelievably pissed off this has been making me for the last several days. I've just been getting so many DMs left and right of horses that are consistently abused in protests, and I know that there's going to be a billion more protests because the Breonna Taylor trial just ended, and so I know that that's going to wreak havoc on fucking everyone. Just don't ride your horses. You can have whatever stance you want to have, be on whatever side you want to be on, believe in whatever you want to believe in, stand up for whatever you want to stand up for, but do not involve an innocent animal and put them in harm's way. 
And it should frankly be illegal to ride horses in riots and protests, including the police. They should not be allowed to do it. I don't give a shit about what anybody says. I don't think it's appropriate to put an animal in harm's way. So anyway, guys, that was the end of my rant. I did want to say we did just restock the Ethical Equestrians Equestrian Club dad hats. These will go completely out of stock in, I think, two weeks time. They will not come back at any point. So if you want to pick those up, the link is in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video, which will be much more put together and just and better all around. I'll be in a better mood. <laughs>